welcome to episode 5 of the Wood Whisperer video podcast. Today we actually have a very special holiday edition of the show. It's our holiday buying guide. I've actually got my beautiful wife here with me, Nicole. She's going to help me out with uh, just introducing some of the products to you. Uh, and in fact, tell everybody what we usually do every year when these catalogs come in the mail. Well, as you saw, when these catalogs come in, uh, Mark finds a lot of different ways to let me know exactly what he's looking for for Christmas this year. So we thought we'd put this podcast together to kind of give you and your loved ones a, a better head start this holiday season. A lot of the items that we're going to feature today are actually available in the Wood Whisperer store. Now that's a new feature of our website. Just click on the Wood Whisperer store button right there on the home page and it'll take you there. The Wood Whisperer store is actually an Amazon.com affiliate site, so everything that you can find on Amazon is also in the store. But it's a good place for me to feature special products, you know, things I want to bring your attention to and make them very easily available to you directly through the website. It's a great way to support the show and it's all the same prices that you'd find if you went directly to Amazon.com. Yes. <laughs> See. <laughs> So the first category we're going to talk about are the gifts that are $10 and under. So these are really great for stocking stuffers. Um, really? Get a big stocking. <laughs> That's not big enough. I've got one twice the size. That's yes, what you need to get. Exactly. So the first product we're going to talk about are nozzle caps. These are actually really affordable. They're about $7 um, for a bunch of them. How many do you think? I don't know. 25 or 30. 25 or 30? Yeah, I think I'm in a little, you know, puck shaped container, but they're actually pretty cool. If you look here, I've got a little uh, tube of liquid nails that had I, I actually ran out of them. Had I uh, had a few of these around, you actually can sort of roll it down on the tip of this and stop it from solidifying in the tubes. The next product that we're going to talk about are the acid brushes. Now, these are great little things, and I know Mark uses them a lot. I see them laying around on the shop floor all the time. Um, in fact, I've even stole a few of them from time to time and used them in my crafts. He doesn't know that, though, but you know now. How dare you, woman? <laughs> um, these are great uh, tools. You can get a pack of these, 72 of them, in fact, uh, for around $6.99 from the Wood Whisperer store. 72 for 6.99 is an awesome price. I know uh, a couple times a year Rockler has a big sale and I stock up and I, I wasn't even aware that this price was out there. So I think from now on, I'm gonna do that because that's just their regular price for 72 pieces. So the next item that we have are Easy Mark Marking Lines. These run around 3.99 and you can get these at Rockler. I actually have no idea what they are. <laughs> I've probably bought them at now, some time. Actually, we haven't. This I found at Rockler last night, and I guess they're new. It's one of those things, and Rockler has a knack of inventing things that we can make ourselves, but if you're a little bit lazy and you want to save some time, uh, you could purchase these things. They're actually elastic cords connected with um, just the little metal uh, pieces at the end, and you could stretch these across. Uh, let's say you're making a bookcase, or so, usually for casework, and you know there's actually a piece of material under the workpiece and you want to drive some nails through. Usually you have to scribe a line, you know, sometimes you might run a piece of tape across there to mark where your actual nail line is. These, you, uh, I think they come in a, a three pack and there's three different lengths, so 10 inch, 20 inch, and 30 inch, and you just stretch them across the, the space there and it gives you a perfect line that tells you exactly where you need to drive your nails and it doesn't mar the surface. Okay, so the next product that we're going to talk about are push blocks. Not to be confused with push sticks. So these run around $7 and again you can get these at the Wood Whisperer store. So I know for me I feel much better knowing that Mark is using these to push wood through his table saw. Still got all my fingers. Yay! So I know these are very very handy for the woodworker. Yeah, I, I mean, I like to keep two of these at every workstation, the router table, joiner table saw. Uh, it's a real safe bet if you know a woodworker, chances are they could probably use a couple more of these guys. So it's a good thing to stock up on and it's a pretty good price too. Clear! <laughs> okay. Now we're going to talk about the price range between $10 and $25. Now these kind of open up a lot of different areas for us with the books and the DVDs. So really what I've given Mark a few times um, that I personally even 
liked reading were the Taunton books. So basically you can get any of the Taunton books and really know that you're getting uh, your woodworker a very quality product. So here's just an example of a set. Now this definitely goes beyond the $25 mark, but you can buy these books uh, separately. Yeah. So things like, you know, using woodworking tools, finishing. Definitely, these, these in particular, I know when I was first starting out, were just an incredible resource. They were just packed with awesome color pictures and really great explanations. Uh, I have to say, anything by the Taunton Press, I, I think I even told Nicole that a few years ago, just anything by the Taunton Press, I'll take that book because it's, it's gonna be a winner and it's gonna be something that you'll use as a reference probably for the rest of your woodworking career. In addition, you can also, if you're not really looking for either a DVD or a book, they also have magazine subscriptions out there. Um, I know I've gotten Mark a number of magazine subscriptions, including Fine Woodworking, but you mm -hmm. can also get those from our the Wood Whispers store. Those are available through yeah. Amazon? Yes, they are. Who knew? The next product that we'll talk about is the Project, is it the Project Calculator? Project Calculator. The Project Calculator. And that runs... 1946. Yeah. $19.46. I couldn't remember. Anyway, um, I, you can get that at the Wood Whisperer store as well, among other places. I think I actually got ours from Lowe's. I remember buying this. I don't know, but I love it. The project calculator is essentially for the average woodworker. Um, it's just a time saver. Anytime we have to do fractions, you know, if you have to know simple math like 15 30 seconds minus, uh, you know, 3 64ths, uh, this guy can actually plug in uh, the numerator and denominator of a fraction and do the math for you. The next product we'd like to recommend is the tri roller, oh, tri function roller stand. <laughs> I don't know, I'm just reading these things. And that's going to run 1997 from the Wood Whisperer store as well. Yeah, the tri-function roller stand is awesome. It's, uh, I think most of us have some form of a roller stand in the shop for either the outfeed of the table saw or if you have a miter saw and you need something to support a long workpiece. Uh, this tri-function one is actually pretty cool. Uh, it's got a rotating head at the top uh, with three different functional sides. And one is, uh, I believe one can actually be used as a stop on a miter saw, but it's flat, just plain metal. Uh, rotate it once and you get a side that is a standard roller, ball bearing roller. And the third side is actually eight ball bearing rolling uh, individual balls, so it's sort of a multi-directional stand. Uh, these things are just priceless to have around in the shop and uh, it's basically like having a helper there with you since I don't have a helper. No, not me. Okay. So the next product that we'd like to talk about is the leather shop apron. That's pretty sexy, huh? Mm -hmm. All right. It looks good, yeah. especially if you have a beard. <laughs> That's gonna run around $29.99, and again, at the Wood Whisperer store. Yeah, shop aprons, I don't know. Some guys don't like to wear them. I've got one, I wear it in the winter time because it's too hot in the summer. Uh, but it's just nice if you've got a pocket plane, some pencils, a little measuring device. It's nice to just have it on board, ready to go. And it makes you look like a real woodworker. Not a nerd? No, that's pocket protectors oh. for nerds. So the next product that we're going to recommend is the Marple's Chisel Sets. Well, hello, Jax. We have a visitor. Hey. Hi, Jax. Want a kookie? Go lay down. Good boy. <laughs> um, those are going to run around $49.99. Again, you can get these at the Wood Whisperer store. It's the other dog. Now, this is actually a six-piece set. It's one of those gifts that, you know, that you're... <laughs> Your woodworker may already have uh, chisels, but the marples are just a great shop standard. Uh, they're, for me, I, I have a Japanese chisel set. I really baby those. I'm very careful about what I use them on, but I need a knockaround set. I need one that's gonna take the use and abuse of just everyday usage, and the marples are a great way to get there. The next product we'd like to recommend is David Mark's Woodworking uh, DVD. This runs $29.95, and you can get this from David's website at djmarks.com. If you're not familiar with David, uh, he is the host of the woodworking show Woodworks on the DIY channel. Uh, he's actually just an incredible woodworker, and I had the good fortune of apprenticing uh, with David a few years back. Uh, if you've ever seen any of his work, David is just amazing. He's an amazing artist. He's amazing as a friend and a person. Uh, his work is just never straight. Everything is curved. 
uh, and that's really a, a tough barrier for a lot of woodworkers to break through. We want to make everything straight, we're comfortable with um, you know shaker and mission style furniture, but how do we start making things curve? Uh, that's what this DVD is all about. It's actually focused on jigs and fixtures to create curvilinear work. Uh, so it's definitely, if you really want to start stepping up the complexity of your projects and moving on to that next level, that's a good way to start. Now we're going to talk about the $50 and plus category. Um, this is really power tool uh, territory that we're in. So if you are wanting to buy power tools, we recommend that you actually talk with your woodworker about the type of, type of tools that they're, they're really wanting for Christmas. Mm -hmm. So what we'd like to do instead of talking about power tools is kind of talk about some alternatives um, in this price category range. So the first product that we're going to talk about in this $50 plus range is the WorkTunes headset. Um, this is going to run $59.95 and again you can get this uh, at the Woodworth store. Um, on many occasions I've gone and tried to get Mark's attention and lo and behold he's wearing these things. Ooh. So I have to do the little light flashing thing and that doesn't really go over so well either. Um, can I sing for you? Of course. I've had a lot of requests for more singing. I'm gonna start singing, I'm just kidding. The, uh, these guys are awesome. I believe they have like a 22 decibel protection. They're earmuffs and they're a radio at the same time. The next product that we're gonna recommend is similar to the past product we just talked about, the headset. Um, this is actually by the same company mm -hmm. and it is the WorkTunes i3 headset. Right. Now there's some additional features with this headset if you're looking to be uh, attaching your iPod to it. It's actually the same price. Uh, interestingly enough, I did a little research last night and found it uh, $30 cheaper than my other sources at uh, Sears.com. It's $59.99 and it's the same price that the other work tunes are available for. Except for these actually not only have the AM FM tuner, but they've also got a port so you could plug in an MP3 or an iPod, which is awesome for me because I like to listen to podcasts during the day and these are just very comfortable things to wear and if I've got the, the content I want going through them, I'm a happy camper all day. So highly awesome. recommend them. Yeah. Two thumbs up and that's on my list. I want it. Okay. Okay. So the next product that we're gonna recommend is a branding iron. Um, this particular one, we got at rockler.com mm -hmm. and it runs for $69.99. It's actually pretty cool. I mean, I know a lot of guys wanna know, and girls wanna know, how do you sign your work? You know, how do you actually put your name on it? Um, this is one way to do it. It's an awesome little uh, branding iron. It says handcrafted by and they'll put your name on it for you. Uh, you just basically heat it up for about 10 minutes, press it to the workpiece, usually somewhere out of the way, uh, and it brands it right in there and it'll last forever. So, very cool gift. Um, again, something I wouldn't necessarily buy for myself, but I did receive this as a gift, so uh, I use it all the time. Uh, it's also really good for marking your property. <laughs> yeah. Now I know we've mentioned specific items in different price ranges that are really going to help you out, but I just have a little bit more advice if you're really stuck for an idea. Uh, if you happen to be somebody who likes to frequent yard sales or flea markets, things of that nature, keep your eyes peeled for hand planes and bench planes. You can get these old classic planes for just dollars, three dollars, five dollars, whatever it is. They're very cheap and I don't know any woodworker that would turn down a free plane. Uh, it's just a nice refurbishing project. There's a lot of information on the net about how to process them. It's a lot of fun and it's a great way to spruce up a classic tool. Even if you never really use it, you could put it on the shelf. It's a great decoration, uh, but most of them are completely serviceable, mm -hmm. very cheap, really inexpensive way to, to make a woodworker happy. We hope you've enjoyed our holiday gift guide podcast. Now, whether you get your gifts from either catalogs, the internet, our store, or even the brick and mortar stores themselves. We hope this information will help you get the perfect gift for your woodworker. Now we're actually going to have all the links to all of these items right there in the write-up on the website. And don't forget anything that's available at Amazon.com, you just click on the Wood Whisperer store button and I'm going to have every item there for you, very easy for you to shop. So if you have any questions or comments or just need help finding that perfect gift for the woodworker in your life, please email us at thewoodwhisperer at gmail.com. And we hope you guys have a happy holiday, drink lots of coffee and hot chocolate, eat lots of cookies and other baked goods, and uh, we will see you on the next uh, non-holiday edition of the Wood Whisperer podcast.
Happy holidays. Bye.